<laughs> you know what that time it is, ladies and gentlemen. It's another case of Happy Fuck the Cops Day! Bye! Police! Blue Light Murder! Sit spit on that, you fat fucking pig! Oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, my goodness. This has got ties to a, to a known famous cop watcher in the Denver area. <laughs> Hey, he said, how is that so, CM, man? Due time, give it due time. But anyways, this video is called Cops Getting Called Out for Abuse of Power. White man uses his privilege for good against the cops. Let's roll this puppy. Get in the car. Get in the car. Yeah, get in the car, you fat pig. Go guard, go along, move along, go to Dunkin' Donuts when still open. <laughs> yeah, I like this dude. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. You don't care about him. Yeah, I would tell this fucking cop, yeah, get the fuck out of here, you fat fucking tub of shit. You don't care about public safety. You're just a tyrant. You're a fucking bootlegger. You're trying to throw it, flush your power. You're not a peace officer. You're a fucking coward. Get your fucking mentality blue line, bla fla thin blank flag, and get the fuck out of here. You fake guys, gang gang fucking po po. Fuck that shit. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, go catch real criminals. Go catch a fucking chomo. Instead of harassing people out of park in the street. Yeah, get out of here. Damn. You're dismissed, officer. Kick rocks. According to the report, these officers, they were just harassing individuals in that locality. We're talking about the LAPD. And this one white male decided he was tired of it. He got up and started telling them, to get the hell up out of there and stop harassing everybody else. Um, if the police officers were in the right, they would have enforced their authority to do exactly what they were already doing. But they knew they were in the wrong. But that's not all it takes. It, they can know they're in the wrong, but if you're not a person they respect in the community, they're not going to listen to your, uh, to, to your proclamation that you're in the wrong. They're not going to listen to anything you say. Are these men harassing you, citizens? What probable causes oh, you hear that? Oh my goodness. Yes, ladies and gentlemen. That is the one, the only Eric Brand. Yeah. No justice. No peace. Fuck the police. Yeah. Hell yeah. Hashtag free Eric Brand. Hell yeah. Hashtag happy fuck the cops day. They have to ask you for your ID. Yeah. What about it? Doesn't look like there's anything out of it to me. Looks like a brand new bottle of beer. Not even open. That seal is not even broken. I can see it from here. Look at that. That is a fully intact seal. She's not committed. This woman has committed no crime. She is being harassed by the Denver Police Department. They're charging her with by drinking in public. I love that. What the fuck is wrong with these people? No justice. No peace. Fuck the police. Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha. Get the fuck out of here, pig. Yeah. No justice. No peace. These stupid ass. Yeah. Get the fuck out of here, pig, and stop harassing innocent citizens. You're dismissed, officer! Walk a shame! Walk a shame! Damn, that was beautiful. Hell yeah. Let's put up a picture of these harassing ass cops. Anyways, yeah. But before we continue, let's get up for Eric Brand! Come on, baby! Yeah! Hashtag free Eric Brand! Yeah! Who literally went and walked and just went to the corner. Yeah. You can purchase alcohol in the United States. Yes, of you can. You can walk around with it. It is not a broken seal on that bottle. Yep. Why do you think these cops were going to try to cite her for public consumption of alcohol when there was no consumption of alcohol in the bottle? None at all. Open? 
Yeah, it's really interesting. You find the craziest videos, by the way. <laughs> like, wow, okay. Definitely there was a seal. Clearly they couldn't do it. And, you know, great for that guy for calling them out. But also, I have to say, I'm glad the police officers walked away. And yeah. they didn't try to cite her for public intoxication or honestly something else. Because, you know, at least in the moment, they realized they were wrong. Should they not have done it to begin with? No, but I'm glad they at least walked away and didn't come up with something else. Who knows, maybe like jaywalking. I mean, there's so many things a police officer can cite somebody for. I'm oh, glad God. they at least walked away. Oh, this is a good one. Check this out. This corporal officer entering. Oh! I remember, dude, this was a cut. This, this is from Santa Ana Audis. I covered this story. Yeah, I covered this story about, about four months ago. This guy was doing simply a cop watching, and the cops stopped blaring a copyright song from the Toy Story called You Got It For Me. Copyright a song. They were blaring that for this guy. I hope it gets a copyright strike as a sound. This is how dirty these tactics cops are, ladies and gentlemen. And here we go. Yep. Now I remember this. Uh, this was recently uploaded to YouTube. Yep. Uh, and this is the police waking up the entire neighborhood because they have decided to blast music so that the content of recordings cannot be shared to a social media platform. These detectives. And that, that's how I remember we, we, I covered about the base of, of that video. It's, you probably have to dig about four or five months. I remember it's called Cops Play Copyright Music Void Online Post. They were trying to get this co this cop watcher, a First Amendment auditor. They they were trying to him if he posts his music up, uh, this goes on YouTube. He'll get struck down for copyright infringement. Dibs obviously did not do their homework because it just so happens that the councilman lives in that neighborhood yeah. where they were blasting the music. I remember that. Yeah, his name is Hernandez. Hernandez. Here's what Councilman Hernandez said. So what's going on? Uh, no, this is her. Yeah. Why are you playing Disney music? Why? Because it's copyright infringement for him. She knows I have a YouTube channel. Apologize to him. Let's chill and live here. Have, have respect for my community. I do. Do you live here? Do I live here? No, I don't. Well, maybe you should treat us. I do her day. You would if you lived here. Take like the man with your music. So the council yeah. member and the YouTuber connected together, politician and community, mm -hmm. to go after the cops who were out of line. Yep. Beautiful thing. Doc, thoughts on this? Couple. Um, first, obviously, Disney cannot catch a break right now um right. you know in the old days it was just like dumbo and pinocchio and now they're getting dragged in i mean they just want to make some kids happy and they're in the middle of seemingly every story right now so shout out to disney when you blast music like that it suggests that you're covering something up um and the whole idea of having cameras and open recordings and records is to say look we're not doing anything wrong this is transparency we're here to serve the community uh, and so if you're if you're doing that blasting music is the wrong thing to do because it suggests you're doing something that you don't want anybody to hear about yep. and the second of course is when you're blasting music at 11 o'clock at night even if it is like lovely little disney music yeah. you're penalizing the entire yeah exactly <clears throat> That's why a lot of times when I do my like my news stories or like that, I don't put any music in the background, none at all. I mean, drum and bass is the least uh, type of music to get copyrighted. It really is. I mean, sometimes you get copyright match, but it's least likely to copyright. But if I when I do my news stories, I don't put music on the background, none at all, because I want this. I want this to have been completely original. Get my thoughts on there. Now, if I do like a ha ha rant video, or music video, yeah, because it's to spice it up. But when you do news stories like this, you don't want to be like that. But hey. Let's glorify one more time of Eric Brown. Yeah. No justice. No peace. Fuck the police. Happy Wealth of Cops Day, ladies and gentlemen. Fuck the police. Blue Lies Murder. Pair back to blue. Hashtag free Eric Brown. That's right. Come and get some pigs. Oink, oink, oink. Got three fucking clock. With that said, I'm out here. Mike, y'all. Peace out.